That boy, Dragon. That's your boy, hey, man. That's your boy, Like It. We back with some new heat for y'all today. Like this shit up. You heard what she said. Too cool. Let's get it. Hey, we back. Yeah. Episode 70. You know what I'm saying? Right off the Akashi duck. It shocked everybody. 70 episodes in. And stuck this little long hand up there. It was like... That <laughs> stuff was crazy, G. What you think? You think they're about to, like, take off on us now? I mean, I would hope so. It's the final game, season three. I mean, you hope so. I would hope so. I, I gonna, need them to deliver. Like, Rock was saying, you think they're going to take off on Siren? I mean, ain't well, they, they taking off right now? They're already up like 20 points. They're already there. taking off. They need to slow down. See, so we got to figure out some way to stop them. You know what I'm saying? I got she just coming out with something new every time. Not yeah. even him. The, the other the other cast members as well. Yeah, we need Kuroko, man. Hey, we need him to do something. He got to figure it out. He bail us out all the time, so. Exactly. Let's get it. Let's run it up. <laughs> Yo, Siren, there's one thing about Siren. We don't give up, bro. Oh, the dark despair. Ooh. We already got that. It's 20 points in. Who got who? Kagami? Fist bumpo? Dang it, I want to see that. You don't get jealous? He broke him the game, man. Oh, yeah, we ain't giving up. We played off the ball. Come on, Hugo. Oh, that's cash. Good play, y'all. Good play. Who did it, too? What are you talking about? What? I mean, it's a championship game. It's a game of light. <laughs> Let's go. Don't say nothing stupid. Dang, they all saying it. Tip soon. Send me ain't still in it. I can see. Man, Dang. beat you till you dead. It's a pump fake. No! He's smiling. Man, you know the percentage? What? He knows? This man looks like a robot. That's the voice. Oh, he's trying to get the, the foul on him? He stuck his flag out, man. Get the rest, man. Messing up. No! The light going down. Hey, don't get, don't get kicked out the game, Hugo. Somebody go grab him. Oh my gosh! Ain't no point in talking to the refs. I think he never got a technical foul. So now they're gonna try to take out Hugo, and then next is Kagami. Damn. Hey, emotions, man. You can't control him. Rico, man, you the coach. You can't be looking down. Dang, everybody, everybody counting us out. You say said it's not over yet. Completely Kick dead. Take a man until he's dead. This man said it himself. He's a chill. Just a win. The door to the zone is heartless. To those who ask for help. The door look kind of cold, though. Look, he said you said that. How you know? This man, you ain't even got zone. How the freak you talking about zone? Maybe he asked for help and he was like, <laughs> nah. Is it gone? It's gone. Everybody heads down, bro. Oh, this, this is perfect time for Kuroko to come This is making in. me sad, G. I still believe Kuroko ain't figured it out yet. I'm mm -hmm. ready. You got your friend's wristband on. What is it? Go, 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 go. Showing his emotions. He back crying. Number two. Man, number two sitting <laughs> in a nice spot right now, man. What's up, Alex? Number two, hype. Four boy in basketball. What are they all looking at? Kuroko ready to go in? Let's go. We back. Yo, that gave you a little chills coming down my face, man. You know what I'm saying? You got that look. Kuroko not playing, bro. He said, I'm a real Kuroko. 
Yeah, so original, my freak. Yeah, that's funny. You the imposter. Don't even talk to him, Kuroko. Don't even look at him. Dang, he talked to him. Let's get it. We ain't no punks. You ain't gonna crush us. It's facts. You bleed to the rest of the team. Stay on it. Yo, she tipping. Dang, she's singing out Kuroko. Oh, yeah, we screening. It. It's too late. Let's go. Bank shot? Dang, Kuroko versus a Kuroko wannabe. Dang. Dang. <laughs> I got your back, Kuroko. And he killing. Ooh. Oh, yeah, we in his head. Looking for Kagami. We in he's his head. He's about to focus on Kuroko. That's true. Shade. He the worst shooter. Dang. He called Kuroko worthless. Yeah, got make people mad all the time. Dang, he automatic. Old six man. They wearing him out or something? Takio told me. Let's go. I'm a phantom six man. Dang. Kuroko. Let's get it! He started a conversation. Hey, regular pass. Let's go. Dunk on him. Let's go! Get yeah. back hype, yeah, y'all! Like he just gets started. What happened? One-on-one! Over one. right. What the? Oh, that's why he was letting them shoot. Oh, that's smart. Doug is grave. Yes, good rebound. Man, I went in there and broke everything up. Kuroko. Defense wins game. They'll call a timeout. Akashi going to threaten to cut his eyes out again. He's probably going to take his eyes out and put somebody else in there. Oh, yeah, who was that? Not other Cheetah. than Kagami. Yeah, look surprised. Let's go! Inspire him. Damn, for real? Zone? Let's go! Yeah, we're red marker at. We're on red marker at. You really want the red marker Yeah, we're on marker at, man. It's time to go zone, my guy. I had to put lotion on my hands. Could you uh, open that? He stepped back. Hold on, it's zone time, bro. Zone, y'all see with the zone. You too black to be zone. Dang. What's your wife gonna say if you get home with that? Is that a permanent marker? I don't know. Oh shoot. He still able to pass? Why can't me look like he didn't know what happened? And he in zone. <laughs> what are you trying to return back to the shadows? Mm -hmm. Go back to my head spot. Oh yeah, stand out. He all in his head, G. Dang! <laughs> Dang, he reflectively took it. That's the extent? Let's go! Dang, he said the new one. Let's go. You ain't beating that, bro. Be the real cool goal! Yo, she's that That's it? Dang, we down like, what? 19. Yo, we need more. I thought the lead was at least 12. <laughs> Sub them out. Friendly when they can use me. Dang, now you understand it, huh? He gonna keep him there. You done messed up now. He just looked at him, G. That's like waiting for your parents to get home and you didn't clean the house up. <laughs> they come look at you, you be like, like you know you about to get one. Nah. <laughs> Still out there. What did he do to him? That's a surprise coming from him. Oh my gosh. This dude be knowing the right stuff to say to people. What the? <laughs> Zoom. It was a blink of an eye. 
Is that a ring of fire? This man got a spell? Dang. I don't expect anything from him. He know it, he just using them. That's a floor general, bruh. That's crazy. But the one thing I like about this episode that it was it was like strategy. Yeah. It was a lot of different wasn't too too flashy, it was more of yeah. just chess match. I had to go zone for this one, man, you know what I'm saying? Cockney came in kinda cold. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Action. Hope y'all see what I'm seeing. <laughs> action, I'm gonna give it a uh an eight. I think it was some decent action with the strategies and uh, them going back and forth, but we still down. I feel like we ain't even closing the gap. Although, All that was just for like four point, five point, you know what I'm saying, increase. Right. But I'm super proud of Kuroko, bro, for standing up when everybody else is losing hope. Yep. He stood up, you know what I'm saying, cried, got everybody in the game, and they started coming up with strategic ways to like find themselves back into the game, or at least not to lose heart. Yeah. So that was that was pretty cool. I'm going to give it an eight for action. I'm going to go ahead and give it a, a eight two. It was a lot of strategic moves. That's what I liked about it. I really enjoyed the last part. I don't know what Akashi did with that ring of fire, but somehow they was able to score. Kagami going back in the zone was pretty good. Kuroko, you know what I'm saying, getting his, well, losing his presence once again. That was pretty good, you know what I'm saying, stepping back into the shadows and overwriting this dude, you know what I'm saying, this freaking copy. So Facts. I enjoyed all of it, man. And then the uh, six-man dude, that dude was scoring, bro. He had like five yeah. points yeah. back-to-back. So we he definitely need that. And to actually see somebody get a technical foul, I didn't want them to get one, but it's cool to see more like basketball rules get implemented, like, you know, shooting a free throw, yeah. you know, stuff like that. So that yeah. was pretty impressive. Yeah. Emotion, I'm going to give it a 10, bro. A lot of emotion in this game. Like, it was a... Couple times where I felt like jitters in my face when Kuroko stood up, when um, like you say, when Hugo went for that technical foul, like that's so out of character, bro. Like, and then when you drew in your face, chill. Hey, G, when Kagami went zone, that stuff was lit. I had to go zone with you, Kagami. I'm right here with you, man. I'm gonna give it a whole 10. Motion. I'm going to give it motion. I'm probably give it an eight. It was most things that got me was the, the fact that Kuroko. You know what I'm saying? Battling against just this onslaught, bro. 20-something 20, 20 points down. It was more so about him just getting off the bench. We, we've been waiting for that. Like, I've been waiting for I've been waiting for him to get off the bench and just figure out how to beat Rockers in. And then um, seeing seeing just Akashi choose the option that everybody didn't think he was going to choose by keeping the guy in. Yeah. That was kind of crazy. Like, that dude was going through a lot. Like, that person, I don't know what his name is. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. The uh, Yeah. He was going through a lot of emotional Kuroko stuff, wannabe. bro. Yeah. Like, he got to deal with Kuroko being in his face. He got to deal with the team talking smack about him. Yeah. And he got to deal with Akashi. Yeah. He the main person got to deal with Akashi. Akashi's like, like, no, he's like, I don't want to, like, honestly, <laughs> I wouldn't want to be on Akashi's team, bro. Yeah. Like, yeah, he probably my favorite character, but I wouldn't want to be on his team. It's as, like as playing with LeBron. It's, it's might be playing with, like, like a lesser, like, it's like playing with like a version of Chris Paul, cause you know Chris Paul is, is pegged as the like the worst teammate, mm. just want to win. Yeah, it's been said. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I ain't played with Chris Paul, but it's just like playing with somebody who's super good. Yeah. But it's like they have that that negative energy. I don't think LeBron has that negative energy though. Yeah. I feel like he just wants to win. You better shoot. You better make the shot. Facts. Simple as that. But yeah, I mean he did leave Cleveland, so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's but crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and give it an eight. Character development, uh, I'm going to give it a 9. Just seeing Kuroko uh, come back in the game, because we didn't know, I didn't know how he was going to come back and make yeah. an impact on the game. Like, what was going to trigger that? Yeah, he came in and he made himself shine less than the fake Kuroko so that he could get his direction back. Like, that stuff was that stuff was lit, bro. And he sparked the whole energy back in the team. Like, you need that. And when you're playing games and stuff yeah. like that, like, you need somebody that's never going to give up, bro. Big facts. You know what I'm saying? And that, when he came in and did that, that was lit. Then uh, Akashi, um, with the Kuroko wannabe dude, yeah, he got to see a different side of Akashi. He's in, like, Maya or something like that. Yeah, my, I'm going to say like Maya. I'm going to say Maya. Yeah. He got to see a different side of Akashi 
with Akashi not really caring about him, using yeah. him as a tool, as a pawn, you know what I'm saying? Even with the rest of the team, he got to see a different part of that, you know what I'm saying? So he's basically he's acting nice. Right. So he didn't know about that, but now he's starting to see it. You know what I'm saying? He based it, the same thing that happened to him that happened to Kuroko. Yeah. Just kind of like, like oh, I don't need still. you like that anymore, but I still use you. Right. It's like it's not about the team. It's like, oh, well, you know, you don't bring that to the table. So just try that's to better than him trying to stab him or pluck his eyes out or something. I'll take it. Yeah, that's true. So I'm going to give it a nine. I'm going to go ahead and give it a nine as well. Uh, it was a it was a lot of development outside of, you know what I'm saying, the six man stepping up. Like, that was big to me. Like, him yeah. getting them five points was big. Like, Hugo, you know what I'm saying? That kind of messed me up because he's supposed to be the one that's supposed to be the most, you know what I'm saying, pristine and have his stuff together. He's, he's the a captain. captain. Facts. And he did that, so that was some degression right there. Y'all know what I'm talking about. And then we got pretty much Kagami going back in the zone because he felt he felt Kuroko's just like, you know what I'm saying, urge to want to win, bro. Yeah. Nick Kuroko was crying yeah. in a game. That's fact. You still ain't seen him smile, but I feel like we're going to see him smile at the end. But the man's still crying, bro. Yeah. Like... And then, and then just to show that resolve to, like, all, all his teammates, because everybody was like, it's over. Right. Literally over. So, I really enjoyed all that development for every character. Then Akashi pulling out some more crap. Yeah. What that Ring of Fire was. That I don't Ring know if it was just some graphical. Was it like, circus on the court? I don't know what that was. It was something <laughs> new, something we ain't seen. And then we saw him, like, kind of play us. We thought he was being nice for once. But, yeah, he was just like, I can still use you. Watch this. Right. And then he used him. This is just it's just some crazy stuff, man. Yeah. This, dude, this dude is a master chess player. That's true. Ridiculous. I'm going to give it a nine. Yeah, he's super smart, bro. Like, even with the... Uh, Too flash- smart for his own good. Right. With the Literally. flashback when they uh, was at halftime, yeah. he was like, they had 90% certain to win now. Like, like you, you stick know Hugo, you, you, you piss him off, and then, by the way, what happened? Thanks. He gets the tech. You know the percentage, bro? Like, man, get out of here. Man, is ridiculous. That's not crazy, man, but there y'all have it, man. This episode is like, comment, subscribe. Down below. You got any, any remarks? Um, I'm ready to see the next episode. I know y'all ready to see it, so yeah. see y'all next time. Double dragging out. Peace. Peace.